Here's the young lady you know. Look at this face. Sue Ann Langdon. Isn't she pretty? And she's just as charming as she can be. And she is Thank playing you. in Arnie with Herschel Bernardi on right. Saturday evening at 9.30 here on Channel 7. Sue Ann, it's so nice to meet you in person. Well, thank you, Betty. It's very nice to be here. You're very sweet, all those things you said. Well, we're looking forward to Arnie. It sounds like a great show. Well, the reaction to it has been very good. Let's, let's hope the public likes it, too. <laughs> Sue Ann, now let's talk a little bit about the show. All right. It's, it's about a... Uh, uh, Arnie is, is a blue-collar worker. He works uh, on the loading dock of the Continental Flange Company, and he gets a promotion and uh, to the executive wing. He becomes an executive, and the series will deal with how his family and he adjust to money and position and a different way of life. And, but still, it doesn't really change our Arnie. He, he stays the wonderful performer that Herschel makes him to be. He's just a delightful person, Arnie is, and uh, and, and we have a lot of fun with, with, with our problems. Well, we've talked about Arnie. Now let's talk about <laughs> Sue Ann Langdon and her private life. I want to hear all about these Arabian horses you raised. Yes, I hear little girls going to horse camp. Yeah. yeah. I hope she gets an Arabian or two up there. Well, I don't know. <laughs> Are they more, uh, you know, active? And... Well, actually... I, I, it's, it's a history. The, the Arabian is the oldest breed known, and, and I think, I, I find, because I've been around other horses, the, the, the Arabist particularly gets along with, with, the, with man more than other breeds in that I suppose it's due to their history that they stayed in the tents with the Bedouins. You know, they, they had an, have an affinity with mankind. And if you just handle them properly and talk to them, I talk to my <laughs> horses all the time, you get a lot of good, good reactions from them, and they work well. And what about the mentality of a horse? Well, I think that varies like the mentality of human beings. Do you really? I definitely do. Uh, some of them like, and, and, and they're all different personalities, which of course affects your mentality mm -hmm. and vice versa. And uh, of, our, of our six horses, we have six right now, uh, they're all d distinctly different animals. But you can never let them get the upper hand, can you? No, no, no. They, they are, they're, they're not a human. You can't let a human get the upper no, hand. No, they can't let anybody step on you. <laughs> what about, Sue, do other actors in Hollywood have Arabian horses? Is yes, yes. As a matter of fact, there's, there's a lot of interest in horses. In, there are more horses in America today than there were in the days when that was the only mode of transportation and using them on plows and farms. There are 90,000 horses in L.A. County today. Isn't L.A. County alone. And uh, there's a lot of performers that like horses, and those that like uh, Arabs particularly, Mike Nichols raises them, the director. Kim Novak has them. Jill St. John is in the process of getting one, and our neighbor, John Davidson, has, has them. Oh, he's a great neighbor to have. We'll be looking <laughs> forward to seeing Sue Ann Langan and Herschel Bernardi on Arnie on Saturday night at Don't 9. Oh, I won't. Great fun. <laughs>